Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So this is a major collab. It's got loads of different texts taking part in it. Um, I will leave the links to their YouTube channels down below so you can go and take a look at their videos. The challenge was kind of spring, rainbow, um, <laughs> yeah, that was about it really. That, that was what we were given. Um, and Trey got me involved in this one. <laughs> I know, shockingly enough. Uh, Trey is my biggest supporter. She is my biggest fan um, in terms of supporting me and pushing me to try new things. And, uh, you know, she said to me, do you want to be a part of this? She's like, yeah, yeah, that's fine. I was like, that sounds quite fun. Yeah, OK. And then I started to see um, what the other techs were doing, not for this design, but their work in general. And I was like, going, OK, <laughs> it made me a little bit out of my league on this one. Um, and I was actually genuinely shitting myself for... <laughs> this design. I was I, I, I was stressed by this one. Uh, normally I just sit on my table and I'm, yeah, I see what happens. You know, you've seen my, my highs and lows. Sometimes it does not go to plan, but that's fine. It's, it's, you know, but this one, I was actually a little bit, ooh, I'm, I'm, hmm. <laughs> exactly that. I don't know what the word to go with. So there you go. You'll have some incoherent noises instead to explain that one. Um, and I'm not a big rainbow fan, you know, this isn't really my usual genre, um, so it, it probably stumped me for a little bit, and then I had this great idea, and I was saying, yeah, yeah, I know exactly what I'm going to do, and I sat down at my table, and realised it was all upside down, I thought, well, that doesn't bloody help, does it? No. Um, anyway, getting back to the design, I am using Lotus from Moira. And I'm using Nao Nails um, Metallic Yellow. So as you can see, I've done an ombre on the thumb. And I'm doing a bit of colour blocking on the... Uh, where are we? Hang on. Index, middle and ring finger. And then the pinky is also going to be an ombre. Um, but I'm not doing everything. It was colour blocking. This is a bit of a... Yeah, I, I had to play quite a lot. I used so many different mediums. Um, I used Sharpies, I used um, inks, I used gel, um, I used acrylic. I was just playing to try and work out what did I like and what did I want to work. Um, but it was... It was one of these designs that... Once you started it, it this was either going to go really, really well or really, really wrong for the next part. And yeah, I was properly crapping myself. I was like, yeah, did this? This could all go very wrong. And um, my my husband's awesome. He's, you know, Trey is is one of my supporters. My husband is, you know, and he's full of wonderful logic that he will just throw at me and. You know, he just went, well, love, if you f, f it up, just take a thing. Can't you just take a tip off and put another one on? And I went, you are absolutely right. It's not like I'm doing this on a human being. I can just take the tip off. And of course, I'm using with the most giantest tips known to man. In fact, these are cut down. That's how insanely long these are. Um... I love that man. He just, yeah. So after that, he's like, just take a deep breath and off I went. Um, this is called Wow from Smiley's Glitter Store, the glitter I'm just using. And I had a lovely little surprise parcel from Trey. And in it were these little butterflies. Now, I've got lots of butterflies, but I didn't have any pastel ones. And so originally I discounted butterflies in this design because I thought, no, the other ones I've got, they're too kind of in your face. It's wrong for what I'm trying to do with this. And yeah, when I looked in the box, there were these lovely little pastel butterflies. And I thought, oh, beautiful. Yeah, we'll go with those. Um, this glitter, um, I think it's called Wow 15 or something like that. It's a bit of a odd one. When we get to the rainbow part, people don't ask me what colours I used. I don't know. 
I literally just found colours and spent most of the day singing the song red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue to try and remember what order a rainbow is supposed to go out. Yeah. Um, <laughs> bless him, my husband was also wrangling my children to go, no, no, mummy needs to concentrate. Mummy needs to concentrate. Just leave mummy be. Mummy just needs a bit of mummy time to sort her shit out and get this right. Um, Trey also sent me these gorgeous little bunnies that I saw them. I was like, oh my God, you are totally going in this design. Um, so it's almost like the bunnies are popping their heads up out of their little holes. Um, in with the sunshine and the, you know, the sky and the butterflies out and... There's just sparkle, glitter, fairy, whoosh, all over the place too. So here comes the part. Now, I've only shown this on one finger because, yeah, um, it, it's the same process for every single finger. I am using acrylic. I, I've i swapped to, this is a size 2 brush that I would normally use for doing... Um, 3d work but purely because i just wanted tiny beads i want them wet i wanted it to kind of smush together i didn't want any harsh lines because if you look at a ra rainbow it isn't they the, all the colors do kind of fade between each other um and that's what i wanted it to do um so yeah i've kept in one finger of me doing this um i'm not entirely certain why possibly I did this finger, I then went to my husband going, what do you think, does this look okay? Came back to my table and didn't press record again. Is possibly, and most likely, what happened. Uh, this this was done a week ago. Um, I've drunk quite a lot of gin since that time, so I'm not entirely certain <laughs> what happened on my video fail. You know, um, hey-ho. It is coming up. I've got one more working day and then I've got a week off work um, as holiday and I cannot wait. Um, as I've said before, I'm classed as a key worker. So is my husband. Um, so we're trying to work uh, full time jobs and teach our kids, you know, homeschooling two kids um, who are six and eight. Um, it, it's rather chaotic. Um it, it's not relaxing um, <laughs> whatsoever, but both of us, um, he's got, I think, three more days um, and then he's got a couple of days off work as well. And, you know, people are going, oh, you can't go anywhere. You can't. Do you know what? I don't care. I just want to just not focus on anything else. But, you know, my kids, my family. Um, so there you go. There's all the fingers have had their rainbows done on them now i am oh and i put some little flowers sorry about that forgot to mention the fact i put some flowers that is from spring blossom which is from the glitter fairy and now i'm in, coming in with some of these crystals which i think i got from aliexpress um they're not the greatest crystals in the world but they will do for this design um so yeah, I'm looking forward to having some downtime. I'm looking forward actually to giving my house a damn good clean. Um, because yeah, it's just been, it's been full on hectic for the last three weeks. Um, that when I'm not working, I'm so freaking exhausted. We're literally just doing what we have to do. Um, that yeah, I'm looking forward to a bit of a spring clean. Um, getting some workouts in. Um, getting some gardening done. Um, the kids have been really good actually doing, um, we call it nature studies out in the garden, you know, pruning back the plants and what plants are they and we're growing some veggies and things like that. But yeah, so that I'm, I'm looking forward to that. That'll be nice. Um, so we've got some obviously flowers going on on the pinky and the thumb is going to have them as well and then on the other fingers i've come in with raindrops because you do not get a rainbow unless you have rain and sun oh i know that was my thinking uh, i'm just using a bit of chi gel on these just to stick them on sorry i'm also sucking a werther's original 
whilst I'm trying to do this video. Um, Alex has been seriously helping out with, with the housework, bless him. He's done anything that we've asked him to. He's not been giving us any grief. Well, eh, a little bit, but not on the housework front. Um, my kids have chores. Everybody has chores and jobs that need to be done. Um, so he earned some pocket money and got some Withers Originals. And uh, he, he bought me one up because he wanted to share them with me. Bless him. So, yeah, I'm, I'm sucking a Withers Original whilst I'm doing this. I know, you all really wanted to know that, didn't you? Um, so now we're coming in with the best part of any design, which is top coat time. But we are still not finished yet. <gasps> oh no, you beautiful lucky people. Not only have we got ombres, we've got rainbows, we've got fairy glitter. We have got crystals. We have got butterflies. We have got flowers. There's one more thing to come in this design. <laughs> but first let's get through the top coat let's all just appreciate this beautifulness god i friggin love that glitter you know this is the best part for me as well is actually looking back and watching it top coat because of course i'm so busy concentrating most of the time i don't get to appreciate this you know i'm i'm thinking don't stick your head in the way shona <laughs> Am I in shot? <laughs> Things along those lines. I was super chuffed with this set. Like I said, it, it's not something I would wear on myself. Um, but I was really chuffed with, with how this came out. Uh, my God, these tips were an absolute a-hole to um, <laughs> file. <laughs> Being longer than anything I've tried before. That, that was, yeah. So I've top coated. I am now coming in with a bit of chi gel again. And I decided, um, because obviously, you know, you've got to have some clou clouds in this. Okay, and people are painting the clouds on. I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's beautiful and all. But we know, I've done a design before where I've used Perfect, which is from Nao Nails. It is funky. It works great for clouds. Um... So I'm just picking little little clumps up with my tweezers and I'm popping them on there. And I appreciate the fact that my hand is slap bang in the middle of that. Uh, but you will see it again in a moment. So I'm coming in and it kind of makes them 3D clouds. Which is kind of funky. It's kind of awesome. I like it. Um, I didn't want them the, the generic cloud shape. I just want to whack it on there. With a bit of clouds, then I will um, cure that in the lamp. I will brush it off and you will see the final reveal in a moment. Um, so, yeah, thank you very much for watching. I really hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, yeah, I hope you're all keeping well and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.